Today marks 15 years since Hurricane Katrina made landfall, the first strike in Florida, then Louisiana and Mississippi. Katrina leaving New Orleans underwater after two levees flooded 80% of the city. Thousands were left without food, water, or any place to stay. This morning, the cleanup continues from what was Hurricane Laura. Authorities confirm at least six deaths from the most powerful storm to ever make landfall in Cameron, Louisiana. A chlorine gas leak at a plant near Lake Charles caused a major fire Thursday. Nearly one million homes are without power from Texas to Arkansas. Crews from Berkeley and Santee Electric Cooperatives are heading to Louisiana today to help restore power. Somerville Fire and Rescue Chad Lobo is also heading to Lake Charles to help. Eight Red Cross volunteers from the Low Country are also on the Gulf Coast, along with three North Charleston firefighters.